tips for mentor for the mentor newsletter handout and tips for the mentor newsletter feel free to let me know or add to this document um and then i can add it onto there um hey y'all welcome back to my channel my name is desiree and today is going to be a grad school vlog productive day in my life grad school vlog don't know what I'm gonna what this video is gonna be called but it it's definitely a vlog um today is very busy um every day has been really busy every day is busy but um Tuesdays and Thursday I feel like is extra busy because I have like a little I have work and school but um Tuesdays are really my grad school days like really my classes my class days my school days so i have two classes today one class at 4 p.m and one class at 7 p.m and um yeah i just yeah today is just my class day my busy tuesday my busy day my busy tuesday so um right now it is 12 06 i woke up pretty er, i actually woke up pretty early for for actually going to bed late like I went to bed like really late because I stayed up and I just like got a bunch of stuff done for like work in school and um, what's been really weighing on me these last couple of days weeks has been my literature review paper for my intro to canceling class so my intro like my yeah one of my very mandatory prioritary classes that I need for grad school for my particular program and it's basically I have to write a literature review and so I feel like I have written a literature review before but it's like I have been out of school since for a while for a while so just getting back in the groove of like writing papers has been a low-key not even low-key it has been a struggle because like I just you know I'm a little I'm a little rusty to writing papers and so now I'm just like slowly getting back into the game of actually writing papers and it's like I can do it it's just like everything takes me at a slower pace <laughs> so that's why I start things in advance and I seek help I use my resources because I need help and I can't do it by myself so if you're like me who has but also I have learned disability so uh, <laughs> you know it takes me a while but writing is like my thing like I I love writing it's just like I it just takes me a while it takes me a little bit but but that you know so that's been weighing heavy on me okay heavy but I met with uh I made an appointment with the writing center at my college that I attend um and one of the tutors really helped me kind of like organize like my thoughts and like how I want my paper to flow like basically like the organization of the paper and she was super helpful y'all like super helpful so I just I made another appointment to confirm and then um yeah so that's just been weighing on me a little bit so off topic but like I was saying it is 1208 I woke up um went on a walk as y'all probably saw before this video, I'll, I'll post something right here, like a picture or a video. But I went on a walk because my anxiety have also been at an all-time high. Like, I have been very anxious, very nervous, very stressed out. But it felt really good to just, like, walk and, like, to just listen to my gospel music. You know, praising the Lord, worshiping Him as I go on my walk and got my exercise in. I even did a little jog. <laughs> okay i was like who is she but yeah i felt really good i felt really really good so i i went on my walk and then i came back and as y'all saw i had a um a point i had a meeting with my manager um and we went over like our we always have like a weekly check-in so we always have check-ins on tuesdays and so we had our check-in got a lot accomplished in that um of meeting and um so I'm done with that. I do have a couple of things I need to get done for work and also for school. Yeah, I need to like finish these journals. So I just got a couple of things I need to do. First, I'm going to show you all like my to do list for today for work. Um, I'm going to cross out the meeting because that is done. 
okay and then since i have class at four i'm really pressed for time like when i say pressed pressed for time also i haven't had no coffee this morning um and i need it i need coffee right now so we're gonna take a trip to starbucks because <laughs> all right y'all i am in the car and i haven't tried my car mounting like i haven't mounted my camera on my car mount thing and like since the last time like my other video when um my friend Zanae was here um which that was in december it's march uh so that just shows you like i don't be going nowhere uh i'm in the house like i'm in the house working doing school you know but we're gonna go okay so made it home i was you know it is so awkward trying to vlog and drive like i don't know how these youtubers do it i guess you get comfortable after a while but um i'm just sitting in my driveway um car parked uh venti cold brew with two pumps of sugar-free vanilla light heavy cream light caramel drizzle with oat milk with two pumps of hazelnut and y'all it's really good it's like i've been i've been trying to not make i usually just don't i don't like my drinks to be super sweet i like it just right and this is just right it's so good here and get down oh this is what my setup is looking like too um i got another tv tray because i feel like i just need to put like my work laptop there as i work here and just kind of go back and forth and vice versa so i'm gonna sit here for however long to complete my to-do list and let's see how long it takes me oh also i made up my bed it, my bed looks so beautiful and i need to get like a um a picture to hang up up uh, hang up over my bed but yeah this is what my desk situation looking like and we're just gonna go ahead and get to it check in with y'all and i finished some emails so i have crossed that out um so right now i'm gonna cross that out to show you guys okay the lighting is okay okay so I respond to some email that was my sister for the photographer girl um so i emailed her hopefully she gets back with me um i emailed the people i need to i need to go ahead and work on the journals so for my class also that's done and then i need to respond to some work emails i'm gonna do that because i have to send something but right now i need to work on um completing my uh I need to work on completing that assignment because it's due tonight and it's really easy it's basically just like a reflective journal um we supposed to do that every week which i do it every week <laughs> but i just have to add some things so i'm gonna go ahead and do that um, 257 257 where did the day go where did the day go please tell me anyway Ever since the time changed on, was it Saturday or Sunday? Hold on, y'all. My mom needs help. What you said? Yeah, the host to let you in. Yeah, right? It says, wait, just wait. No, you don't have to show your face. I can show you. It's so easy. Okay, I'm coming down. I'll be right back. I gotta help. I gotta help my mom with Zoom. Okay. I got totally interrupted. <laughs> um, I don't even know what I was saying. Not really. I was interrupted by my mother downstairs. I thought she had to do a Zoom. It wasn't a Zoom. It was a. Besides the point. Anyway, it is 3:06. I am almost done. Pretty much done with the journal aspect of it. Um, I actually text one person in my, uh, in my class to confirm, like, one of the journal prompts. And she was like, oh, it's, I forgot. She reminded me. It's not due till midnight. <laughs> okay, whatever. So, the journals ain't due to midnight. So, um, also, I'm eating some organic mini pretzels from Sprouts. These are good. Yeah, so I'm eating some pretzels. Um, I'm gonna finish the journals. I'm gonna try to. 
I haven't done much of like my work to do list for the day. I still need to start working on the newsletter. Um, I need to email a mentor, which I'm going to do right, that right now. And then I'm going to fill out this Vista report. If I can knock out those two things like, like right now, that would be great. Um, and I think that's what I'm going to do before my 4 p.m. class. I'm probably going to be up late tonight. What's new? Because the day goes by too fast. I wanted to take a nap today and I literally can't. Like there's no, there's no time. <laughs> there's no time to take a nap. This is why like I need a vacation. This is why I need a couple days off from work because I literally can't right now. Like I am just like in shambles. I'm not in shambles, but like, you know, it's tiring. I'm tired. It is four o'clock. My class has just started. I got my my mom made some spaghetti. I got my little French bread and I got my salad. So this is what we rocking with. I got my class. <sighs> y'all, I is, I'm a mess. Like I can't believe it's four o'clock. All right, y'all, I'm gonna go ahead and tune in for class and we going back and I'm gonna go ahead and go to class and tune in and then I will check back with you all in a little bit. For a minute. And um, take care, be good to yourself, be good to other people, drink a lot of water, get a lot of sleep, get some sunshine, walk in the grass, be good to yourself. All right, take care everybody. Thank you, bye. bye. Thank you, bye. Good night, good night everyone. Good, night. good morning, it is Thursday, March 18th. Today is my um, short work day slash school day. So I have class at 7 p.m. today. So 7 p.m. to 9.45. As y'all saw just probably in this vlog uh, that I just, um, on Tuesday, on Tuesday. So on Tuesday I have class and Thursdays I have class. I have a team meeting at, um, I'm writing some things down actually I have a team meeting at um at 10 I'm gonna go downstairs and get my coffee side assignment um for my class tonight and then also I'm presenting me and my group have a group presentation today at my in my class and so me and three other uh, of my group members are presenting today. It's our term. We are doing our turn. I'm sorry. We are doing feminist theory. So we're presenting. It's like a conceptualization. Um, uh, like, yeah, it's like a conceptualization um, group project. So in our theory that we're doing is feminist theory. So, hey. So... I'm pretty excited about that. I, we already had, like, we met on Saturday and we all talked about, like, who's going to do which part. So I'm going to go over that a little bit later. I'm going to kind of go over my part before, like, definitely before six. So um, today is definitely a productive day, like, a busy, 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 busy day um, because yesterday I didn't get a lot of things done. And so since I didn't get a lot of things done yesterday, I... I am in this situation. So on my phone, it's this. Um, I downloaded the Notion with the I downloaded the Notion app, 
and um so i have notion on my desktop on my personal computer but i was like you know what since i'm like all about productivity i'm always like there's always things that needs to get done and i really like how notion has like i can like favorite different things and so i created um I created like a Des morning routine on my Notion and then I also created like a Des night routine. It was this girl um, template that I use um, on Notion and it was free so I just used her kind of her layout of that. And so if I click morning routine it's going to say Des morning routine. It's so cute. Um, and it says bloop wake up go 7am. Did I wake up at 7am? No I didn't. I didn't wake up at 7 a.m. today. I was tired. Um, I woke up at 8. It's okay. I digress. So it's good. And it says good morning. And then it has like these little checkboxes. So you can uncheck it and then you can check it. So this morning I avoid looking at my phone. Kind of. I snoozed a lot today. So I guess I can check that out. I pray today. I didn't even do my reading of my Bible plea. I'm probably going to have to do that later on tonight. But I did pray. Like, praying just makes me feel so much better. Like. I love praying and talking to the Lord because we're just I'm just trying to draw near to him because yeah anyway always so anyway I prayed this morning it was pretty short it wasn't 15 minutes um and I didn't read my bible plan this morning didn't have time I did not work out this morning um today there's I'm pressed for time so today like I'm pro I'm not working out I'm being honest not working out so that's not checked off I got dressed I made up my bed. Um, I brushed my teeth. I did a little skincare. And I did not put makeup on today because I was gonna do like a little mascara, a little eyebrow, but can't do it. Can't do it today. <laughs> Don't got time. So and then the total estimate time of completing all these things I said is one to two hours. So that was kind of like my this is kind of like my morning routine. These are the things that I should be doing every single day. Brushing my teeth, making up my bed, praying, okay? Praying to, praying, because uh, that's important. Um, skincare, skincare is important. And now that I'm 25, like the older I get, like I'm all about like just elevating my self care. I need to start exfoliating my body every single day. Like I'm just trying to be cute feminine like I need to step it up because I just need to step it up so yeah I'm stepping it up I'm stepping it up uh and so I really like how it says Des morning routine and then also I'll show you guys like Des night routine and if I click that it's gonna say Des night routine it's gonna say good night and um every night like before I go to bed I should update like my notion like what I need to do for the day was my daily task write out my to-do list for uh, work and school for the next day shower do skin let me actually uncheck that shower take a shower do skincare do my devotional read my bible and pray pray again you see where I'm going we're going we're going we're doing this like every day um twice a day and then drink a glass of water or tea before bed and this is an estimate of two hours i told myself because i'm a little on the slower side so this is i don't do this every night i try i try to do most of this every night i should probably add uh brushing my teeth too uh shower oh br i'm gonna say brush teeth Oh, brush, teeth, and skincare. Okay, there we go. So, yeah, these are the things that I need to be doing every single night. Okay, do I do everything like drink a glass of water? Be like, I do drink water automatically, but do I do my do I do my devotional and skincare every night? No, 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 I don't. Uh, do I write out the to-do list every night? No, I don't. So these are the things that I am working on and I really like having this app because I can automatically uh, click it on my phone because it says like I have this thing where it says favorites. So does morning routine, does night routine and I can click that. So if you are looking for ways to kind of be more productive or ways to kind of get you in the mood um, to do that and also this is kind of a sneak peek into my what my phone looks like and the last 
like the last page of on my phone would be like my social media but right now I'm on a social media detox and this is what my front camera look like so yeah so that is that and yeah I just wanted to show you all what that looked like and how you should really utilize Notion because it's pretty awesome so let me stop talking. Yeah, I mean, that was the highlight, I think. I saw Taylor Swift sitting there looking like a bouquet of flowers from Trader Joe's. Okay, that's, um, who, that, well, that's who that was with that mask. No. Yeah, I mean, her whole, she looked like a, a listen, the five ninety nine bunch of, of flowers from the Trader Joe's. That's oh, what she was know, giving. I love them for dinner. The nice for a Thursday night. <laughs> you know, not, you know not a Trader Joe's. A choice. You know, oh, not Trader Joe's. Like not Trader Joe's. And I can't quite figure out why she just um, but I was very happy. I was very happy for our, our black winners to see Megan up there, get her things. I love seeing Megan. I love, see, you know, we love seeing Cardi, women like Cardi. We love seeing them get their things in these spaces. You know what I'm saying? Because these spaces don't be meant for us. So we're happy to see them get some acknowledgement, some recognition, even though there are long histories of. Um, okay, so it's 2.01. I have a two o'clock student appointment. This is going to be my second and last appointment for the day. So let me go ahead and join this student appointment and we good, we Gucci. All right, hopefully the student shows up. It's a lot going on with the student, so y'all pray for me. This is actually honestly a blessing in disguise and it's better that you are getting prepared to leave now than later because later it's always like it's just you just want to be done with it and keep it pushing so i think this academic year is perfect so with that <laughs> well with that i mean pretty much yeah it's time to go it so it's 301 i am today i have been working i haven't been feeling the best but i have been working and um yeah i've been working and I honestly can't wait until I go on spring break from like work. Um, well, actually not from work, from school. I just can't wait I'm on spring break. But then I'm looking at that spring break is like I need that week is going to be I'm going to be working for three days that week. Um, and I need to do like work stuff. But then also I need to kind of like regroup and start planning out like the rest of the semester for the semester like writing my papers and different things like that um so that's what's going on right now i'm i'm tired i'm tired just got done eating dinner um I got me some more tea I got my water so I'm all ready for class I printed out my case conceptualization paper um and highlighted the parts that I'm going to be printed pre I can't say I printed out my case conceptualization paper and going to be um just reviewing the ones um that I'm presenting to class tonight um me and my group are probably my group and I are probably going to go ahead and be the first person to first group to present tonight which is totally fine I want to go ahead and get out the way and um yeah that is it for today's vlog or today's video whatever um I hope you all enjoyed this vlog I combined Tuesday and Thursday in this vlog and yeah if you haven't already make sure you subscribe to my channel i would greatly appreciate it right now i'm at 130 subscribers like which is like crazy because i was at zero before i was at two for the longest time <laughs> anyway but i hope you all are doing well and um stay safe and please make sure you check out my other videos and click the notification bell if you subscribe to my channel cool all right y'all peace out